first thing is, uh, one year ago, I had met you and mm. I had asked you whether you're going to contest the presidency. Mm. And at that time, you had asked me, what do you think? Mm. And I said, why not? And here you are. Yeah, I have followed your advice. <laughs> so you vote for me now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my question is this. Now, you just said that you're a lone member. Um, if you win the presidential election, uh, we are obviously going to go in for a general election soon after. Um, what happens then? You, we have parts of the SLPP which has already joined you, but then we will also have your UNP party which will get ready to campaign and win their respective seats. Is it going to be like a national government you're going to be looking at or, or what's going to happen? I would like the voters to decide which party, what comes in. I will work with everyone. I'll ask everyone to come. It's, it's after all for you and how to pay the loans back from 2028. So let's see. Is that invitation also be go going to be open for Sajid Premadasa and Anurag Kumar Disanayake yes, and Namal yes. Rajapaksa? Huh? And? And Namal? Yes, yes. But uh, wait, before I, as I became president, I told Sajid to come, join me. I told Anurag. They didn't do it. They may be regretting it now. What to do? Next time we'll take them all into the government. You have no objection? Okay. We must learn to work together. We are talking on the Westminster system is all right if you follow the rules. If you don't follow the rules, that's the end of it. And secondly, we must look at a political system which supports the basic, the fundamentals. You can define the details. This is what our country hasn't had. That's why I want this country to have that. I think all of you want it.